Hey Easy Technology fans, welcome back to another tutorial. In this video, we're going to be talking about how to fix your Xbox game bar not working on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 more specifically. Now, there could be a couple issues or a couple reasons why your Xbox game bar is not working on Microsoft. One of the reasons could be because of the game bar is disabled altogether. One reason could also be the GP edit disabled the app. Or it could be because the Xbox Game Bar component is corrupted. It also could be the Xbox Game Bar is disabled from registry. And it could be several other reasons. Now we are going to go over the most common reasons to fix why the Game Bar for Xbox is not working on your Windows 11 operating system. So first thing you want to do is simply choose the Start menu and select the Settings. And what you want to do is select gaming and go ahead and select Xbox Game Bar. And once you're on this page, make sure to toggle this on. So you might have it turned off. Make sure to have open Xbox Game Bar using this button on a controller to have that turned on. Now that was the easy fix. If it's still not working, there are a couple more options and things you can do to fix it. So now we are going to reset the Xbox Game Bar component. So from the settings, what you want to do is select apps. Go ahead and select installed apps. And what you want to search over here is Game Bar. So as you can see, I typed in game and you can see this is the app you want to focus on. So go ahead and select these three dots and select advanced options. And it's going to take you into advanced options. It's going to give you some specs, some app permissions, and some other stuff. So go ahead and go down. And what you want to do is simply under the reset section, you're going to choose repair. Now this will take a moment. And once it has repaired successfully it should give you a little check mark right here and now you can try to record using the xbox game bar if it's still not working however you can reset the app instead and that will erase all your apps data so go ahead and select reset reset and that should fix the application for you to record on your Xbox Game Bar. However, if it's still not working at this point, there is another option you can try. So exit this out, right click on the start menu, choose run, and go ahead and type in R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Go ahead and choose enter to allow changes. And what you want to do is simply go ahead and go into this directory that will that I will go to right now. All right, once you get into this directory exactly, then what you want to do is obviously it will show it right over here. What you want to do is select the app capture enabled. Now, if you don't have that, as you can see, mine is missing. So what you want to do is simply just right click anywhere here, select new, and go ahead and select either one D word or Q word with 32 bit or 64 bit. So I'm gonna choose the 64 bit. And here's what you want to type in for that app. So you want to name it App Capture Enabled, no spaces, and select Enter. Go ahead and double click on that you just created. And what you want to do is set your value data to 1 and just leave it at hexadecimal. Choose OK. And now what you want to do is simply just close the registry editor. And all you need to do is restart your computer. 
and you can launch the feature by pressing Windows key plus G on your computer and it should record. All right, so we are now going to try a couple more options. If your game bar is still not recording on your Windows 11 operating system. So now we are going to repair the IE frame DLL file. So what you want to do is select the start menu, type in CMD for the command prompt and select run as administrator. Yes to allow changes. And what you want to do under this command prompt is type in this exact code. All right, once you have all of these commands typed in, go ahead and choose enter. And it should give you all of these lines here. And once you have this similar to mine, then what you want to do is simply exit this out and restart your computer. And now your Xbox game bar recording should now be working just fine. All right, so that concludes my tutorial today. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like the video, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and comment if you have any feedback or questions. Thanks for watching.